Today there was a procession to remember a Dauphin County volunteer firefighter and tow truck driver hit and killed by a car this week. The body of 29-year-old Tyler Loudenslager was escorted from the Reading Hospital to the Hoover Boyer Funeral Home in Millersburg, Dauphin County. Tyler was hit and killed responding to a roadside assistance call on I-78 in Bethel Township, Berks County, Tuesday night. A tow truck drivers say that tragedy is becoming all too common, and first responders are reminding drivers to pay attention to the steer clear or move over law. WGAL News 8's Barbara Barr talked to tow truck drivers who put their lives on in danger to help others. Tow truck operators gathered here at Cabbage Hill to mourn the loss of one of their own and send a message to drivers. Slow down, move over, give us the space we need. We went out on a call with Casey Birkins of Cabbage Hill Garage and Towing. Operators say they're often called to potentially dangerous situations to help stranded motorists or accident victims. He says an increasing number of drivers aren't obeying the steer clear or move over law by shifting into another lane or slowing down when approaching an emergency response scene. Every time could be my last. The operators say drivers need to pay attention to their amber lights as they would red or blue lights of other emergency vehicles. It could be a matter of life and death. The common person looks at our amber lights and it doesn't affect them. It's inexcusable. Pennsylvania State Police are actually taking part in what's called the Move Over Initiative this week, along with some neighboring states trying to get the word out to drivers to obey this law. In Lancaster County, Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.